A couple from Wisconsin just completed America's Greatest Loop. It's a 6,000 mile long trip around the United States and Canada all by boat. It's an adventure considered rarer than climbing, climbing Mount Everest. Jill and James Iverson are with us this morning to tell us more. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Is it more rare than Mount Everest because it's not very fun? <laughs> no, no. Just the fewer people do it. We're not trying to say that it's more arduous or dangerous because it certainly isn't, but it, but fewer people do it. Well, what do you say? Are there fun things to see along the way or is it just? Oh, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. There's, there's a, besides meeting the locals and seeing the sites, it's a community. There's a community of people that continuously bump into each other in different ports called loopers. And you actually build relationships and have a lot of fun. And the cool thing is, is you get to go back on your boat, spend some time with them and then go back on your boat. So it's really nice. I mean, who knew this thing even existed? How did you guys hear about this? Is this, a, is this commonly discussed in the boating circles? Um, uh, actually, it is. We've uh, been sailors most of our lives, and uh, we've sailed in the Great Lakes, and that's uh, one of the paths that the Great Loop goes through. So we met all sorts of people that were doing it, and it perked our interest, and we, we decided, uh, well, why don't we do it? And I'm sorry, 6,000 miles. So how long did this take you? It took one year and eight days for us. Although some people do it more quickly, we really like to spend our time and, and, and see the areas and meet the people. And what's your, was there some place you went that you were surprised by that you liked so much or? That's a great question. I would say Fells Point in Baltimore. We loved Fells Point in Baltimore. We stayed there for a week. Uh, we reconnected with some friends from 40 years ago from Chicago, Brian and Iris, and they showed us the local sites. And Fells Point is a really cool place. I would love to go back to Baltimore again. Huh. All right. Also, there's a small town in the center of Florida called Sanford, which is a very, very charming town. Mm -hmm. And it's old Florida. It's, it's not just walls of condominiums on the ocean. It's very cool. Well, Lots I of wildlife there. Birds that scream, um, they're, they scream and people call 911 because they think someone's being murdered. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's fun. And, and alligators, <laughs> we turn, turn our light on, on the water, our searchlight, and see all these alligator eyes. Really cool. Wow. Well, you can check out more of their trip by following them on Instagram at Jill and James. Thank you both for being Thanks, with us. Thanks, guys. Hey, welcome. Thank you.